All right, welcome back to another video on the channel. Hope you guys are all having a great day. So in today's video, what we're gonna be doing is challenging ourselves again, and we're gonna be using the slowest setup you can possibly make in Modern Warfare. And as you guys see on the screen, we're still using our weed character. I don't have any cool skins on this account, and I just thought we'd go ahead and use it because it's a super trolly skin. But overall, I did see a lot of you guys comment that I needed to use the slowest setup and run around and try to melee people with it. So I thought we'd go ahead and try that today. Before this setup, I actually looked through almost every single weapon in this game, and I made sure that this would be the slowest setup that you could run. And I'm sure a lot of you guys actually thought that this setup was going to include a rocket launcher, but it's actually not going to because the rocket launcher has higher mobility than the setup that we're actually going to run today. Now, I actually went to private match to see which weapon I can make the slowest because a lot of weapons I don't actually have all the attachments unlocked on this account, uh, but it was between the HDR and the Rytek Sniper. Now, as you guys see, I don't have the Rytek Sniper unlocked. I do have a variant of it that came in that weed bundle that I got. So I just went ahead and played some shipment and shoot house and unlocked the attachments for the HDR. So here are the attachments I ended up using on the HDR today. You guys know the runaround when it comes to the breacher device. It takes it from a three hit kill to a two hit kill and it also hurts your mobility. So that was a no brainer attachment right there. The next one you have is the thermal dual power scope, which actually does decrease your mobility and also the FTAC Hunter Scout, which also does decrease your mobility along with the nine round mag. The only attachment I do have on this weapon that doesn't decrease your mobility is the heavy hitter perk. And for heavy hitter, the melee produces a greater stun on target, so it pretty much just disorients them when you melee them. So yeah, that is the class up that we rock today. If you guys have any suggestions for any future class setups that you guys want to see on the channel for challenges and stuff like that, let me know down below in the comment section. Also, if you do enjoy this video, man, make sure you drop a like down below. Let's shoot for 12,000 likes on this video. Anyways, without further ado, let's go ahead and hop into the gameplay. Okay, well, we can practically land anywhere that we want to. I'm thinking downtown and maybe drop it on a scavenger. I don't really see any good scavs. Maybe that one. Just go for that. Might as well, right? Oh, probably should have went to that other door. I don't know why I went to this one. But whatever. Okay. It's in construction. I actually like construction. This is probably my favorite place to land in downtown. You get a lot of cash here. Me probably saying that now, I'll probably not get that much cash, but usually you do get a lot of cash in this area. But I'm picking up guns, as you guys can see. We're on the second account again today, and uh, we're just gonna use guns, mess around. I might end up shooting the sniper rifle that we're gonna be using as well, who knows? We'll have to see. Oh, there's not nearly as much cash as I was expecting here, though. Um, let's just go ahead and get the scavenger going. Thank God it's underneath and not all the way on top of that, bro. That's got to be the most annoying place for a scavenger to go. Wait, who's shooting at me? Oh, there's a guy right here. There we go. That was a struggle. I think this will do close. No, oh my god. How did I get three kills out of that? That was absolutely nuts. I was just so focused up right there. Holy shit. I know you guys could tell I was focused up. I didn't say a damn word. Oh my god. And you got an orange shotgun. You're so annoying. All right, we got our setup. That was kind of nuts. That first guy, I struggled with heavily. And then we ended up doing pretty good for the next three. Ooh, a gold chest and another chest on here. Oh, I was about to say, please. Please bless me with the uh, <laughs> munitions. All right, that's completed. I think I'm just gonna go and get a munitions here. Actually, let's just get a UAV and see how it goes. Because we do have one stun and we can take a dude out with that. Request recon flyover. Okay, next closest UAV is AO. here. Okay, we'll head that way. All right, this dude's going into the building here. Enemy UAV oh, I think he's going in right here. Yep, he's to my left. Oh, is he in the other? Yeah, he's in the other unit. Now he's going up top. UAV is bingo fuel. RTB for resupply. All right, we're going for this guy. You're dead. <laughs> uh, that was a fairly easy kill. I think that dude just literally landed in and it was just going for loot at that point. Uh, yeah, this bounty's all the way on the roof. Let's go for that. Uh, we got about three minutes till we can actually get our our other class set up with restock. So we're going to have to try and get some a little bit more cash going and uh, get us a munition so we can have some stuns and take some people out meleeing them. But man, I just want to talk about how slow this weapon is. You feel like a slug. You're like a damn turtle. So slow and sluggish. 
that's pretty much the point of the setup, you know? Use something, have a little bit of a challenge today. I know a lot of people get mad at me for not actually shooting the gun that I'm using when I do, like, you know, make videos like this. Oh, there's a dude under me. Yeah, I'm getting off. Not worth. Definitely not worth that fight. I'm gonna go up top, and I'm gonna try and land on that chest that's on this building, see if we can get enough cash for munitions here. We really need that. Okay. Clearly, we got no cash. He's all the way on the roof. Okay. Enemy precision airstrike. <laughs> he put down. a precision airstrike on me. This shouldn't hit me. Yeah, we're good. Nice job, buddy. What do you do? Yep, I figured. Nice job, dude. Get an origin shotgun. Get out of here, bro. Your name's oh, Mudbone. Yeah, get mad, bro. Get mad. <laughs> Your name's Mudbone in 2020, dude. What's going on with you? Such a weirdo. All right, that's a bounty on a dude all the way over there. We have six kills right now, yo. We're kind of cooking. I'm surprised that dude pushed me in the way that he did. That was really stupid on his end. He had the high ground in every situation. Dude should have just went with it and, you know, not pushed. Okay, Axel, sent the flyover. Uh, we get our munitions. We go. And we have our dead silence. Alright, the last dude that we see on the UAV is either hospital or literally the bounty target that we have over here. Let's just go for our bounty target. I'm sure there's a couple people here that's ghosted. Oh, now we can get restock. Now, I don't know if this bounty target is going to go for it or not either. But I think we should just wait a second, see if he flies down to it. And then we'll, we'll go from there. Because his loadout is probably going to be in the same place that mine is right here. Yeah, he went for it. You're dead. That was that was easy. Can I get the gas mask? Thank you. The loadout. Oh. All right, there we go. We got one of our HDRs. Oh, something I entirely forgot to do is something I've been wanting to do is actually change my mini map. And mini map is now square. That's something I entirely forgot to do, and I keep forgetting to do on this account. I see people commenting on the videos, and I was like, yeah, I need to do that. I actually need to do that. And I just, I, I never do it. But I finally did it. As you guys see, there's square minimap. I wonder if this is the guy that we killed beforehand, and he just went back to go get his loadout right there. It could be. Now, that guy's dipping off. I don't know where he's going to go. I don't see any bounties ground level. Let's just go hit that buy station there. Get self res. Get a UAV. And we'll get a spare. Oh, this dude's going to this building here. Let's go for him. Oh, he's going to ascend, isn't he? Yeah, he's ascending. Oh, he bought himself a loadout. We're climbing up the stairs, baby. We're not ascending. Ascending would just be straight up stupid to do right there. He's probably going to be ghosted by the time we get up here because he wasn't ghosted beforehand. I'm just going to pop the daddy when we get closer up here. I'm popping this. Okay, he's still up here. I'm popping the daddy now. Oh, my God. You're dead. Come on, bro. Can you get executed? Thank you. <laughs> weed guy versus weed guy. Come on, T-Bone. Let's just land right here and get this bounty. There we go. It's on the dude in the vehicle. That sucks. Right, I'm gonna hit this buy station, get us some munitions. Actually, I don't think we really need a munitions, to be honest. Just scoop another UAV and just get into the area. We need radar. Send recon. Okay, dude in bank. It's good intel. You know we're about to pull up on him, 110%. I can't see shit. Stunned you, buddy. Nope. Nope. Die. Die. Oh, my God. Oh, uh, there's a bounty behind us. kind of just want to go for that. I would run with the gun out in front of me, but I like having a riot shield out just because I, I just I really don't want to get shot by something stupid and die. 
Wow, 16.8k for this bounty, but he's in stadium. There's no reason for me to push that in any way, shape, or form. I think maybe we just kind of chill here and just kind of wait and see. Oh, he got poached. Okay. I think we just kind of chill here, wait, and see where our next move is. We got about another 30 seconds to see where this next circle goes. And we should be in the circle. I hear all these shots. They sound so close, but they're so freaking far away, man. I hate that about Warzone. They really need to change that. Okay, we're in the circle. We're chilling. There is no buy station, so if we do want to go and hit a buy station, we need to relay backwards now. We do have a vehicle with a trophy, but I just don't think it's worth going to that buy station, especially if somebody could be camping up top. At this point, the only other place we could actually get to is blue. I feel like that might be a pretty smart idea. Sucks that there's no buy station here, man. Guess we'll just see if there's anybody chilling in here. Uh, Bertha's pulling up. Oh yeah, he's coming in here. He's definitely coming in here. 100%. Oh, know where I am, buddy. Throw another thermite, slow him down a bit. So we can try and get our sons back. This guy knows what he's doing, though. We don't actually have circle here. We kind of need to move. Gas is closing in. Relocating the safe zone. Loadout drop inbound. You're dead. Ooh. That was a close one. Oh. All right, there's a dude in a Jeep straight ahead. He's going in the building. I'm going up this side. He's going up the other side. I think he's maybe a story higher than me right now. Or maybe he's all the way climbing the roof already. He's on roof. Okay. I'm glad I didn't push up there like that. Oh, wait. No, he's not. Maybe there's another dude roof. It'd be really good if we were in burger or like gas right now. This is kind of a bad spot for us. I'm surprised we've gotten as far as we've gotten with this slow-ass weapon. Dude's busting through doors in the other unit, I'm pretty sure. Actually, there's one underneath me. You're dead, bro. Nope! Oh my god. That's not good. I'm glad he didn't melee as much. If he did, we would have been dead. This is going to be an awkward push into this area, man. I'm just going to have to go for it. Oh, I'm getting fucked up. I'm getting fucked up. I don't know from where. Oh my god, I can't move! I can't move. I couldn't move, dude. I literally could not move. Stupid ass trash can and lunch table. And he was camping in here anyways. That sucks, man. That was a good run for this weapon, to be honest. That was definitely a good run. We got 10th place. We had 11 kills. We popped off at the beginning. It's kind of slow after that, but man. But at the end of the day, I'm not going to sit here and stress myself out using this slow-ass weapon. Because I've I played a good maybe like seven or eight games, and this is hands down the best game I've had so far. It just sucked because we didn't have good positioning. The guys that were in here and, and or in gas had the best positioning, and you know, if I didn't get shot from that guy in the back, I probably would have survived that right there, but who knows. Well, the guy that ended up killing us ended up winning the game, so. Stranger